Tommy was 20 years old when she, he started dating her. She was 15 years old. And uh, her daddy, uh, <laughs> Tommy, doing this. her daddy didn't want Tommy dating her. And I, you know, if you knew Tommy back in those days, he's his brother. You wouldn't want him to date your daughter either. Tommy was a bad boy. Well, <laughs> Margaret finally convinced her dad to let him come over and eat supper. And uh, he said, all right, I'd rather date you, but I'll come eat stupid supper. <laughs> so uh, back in those days, it was called the apothecary. For you uh, younger folks, that's a drugstore. Tommy went to the drugstore and he got, you know, you got everything at the drugstore. He decided he would take some candy to the dinner. And don't put your sticks up yet. <laughs> so he went down to the drugstore and uh, said to the druggist, I got to have some chocolates. Okay, what you want? He said, I want three pounds of chocolates, but I want you to wrap them in separate packages. He said, well, that sounds kind of strange. He says, well, I'm in love with Margaret. I don't know what her name was, Gillicuddy or something like that. <laughs> and uh, her dumb daddy, her dumb, stupid, idiotic daddy won't let me dare, but he is allowing me to come to their house to eat supper tonight. And what her dumb, stupid, idiotic daddy don't know is after supper, we're going to go out on the porch. Well, that's poor John Anderson just a swing in you know. Like, Tommy wrote that song for John Bowen. And uh, so they, what her dumb, stupid, idiotic daddy didn't know, we're going to go out on the porch after supper, and if she'll let me hold her hand, I'm going to give her a pound of that chocolate. You know, that was back in the day, that's holding hands, that was tough, that was big stuff, everybody. And if she'll let me put my arm around her, I'm going to give her another pound of that chocolate. Put my arm around her. You know what comes next, don't you? And if she'll let me kiss her, I'm going to give her all that chocolate. Well, the drugger said, let me know how it works out for you, Tommy. So I will. So he went over to her house that set that night. And sat down. Her daddy said, uh, let's say the grace. Tommy said, let me do it. And y'all got to know something. Tommy saying grace when he was talking. Uh -uh. He didn't do stuff like he was mean. But he raised, he says, he says, let me do it. And Dad said, oh, go ahead, Tommy. Tommy prayed for five minutes over the supper. <laughs> got through eating, went out on the porch, and Mark said, Tommy, I had no idea that you were so spiritual. You pray five minutes over the chicken. He said, well, I had no idea your daddy was the druggist. <laughs> That's all a lie, by the way. In case you wonder, pray for me. Let's have some lies, okay?